Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, it's me Cloxon, and today I want to do a quick lock update before I get my retwist tomorrow. I just want to show you guys how my hair is looking, told you I would uh, keep y'all up to date with my locks. And today, well for the past few days actually, they've been looking kind of sporadic, and this is how it's looking right now, y'all. This is straight up free form. You can see it's not as tight, and actually some of them are even coming loose. I'm going to give y'all a close up. Like the whole... I'm saying it's going crazy right now, but this is kind of what I was looking for. Obviously, not this messy, but this is how freeform locks look, y'all. I was gonna retwist them earlier, but I'm like, you know what? Let me just let me just let them do their thing and just go in whatever direction they want. And you see, y'all look closely. This base is just afro, pretty much right here, and the locks are just coming out of that. So that's the goal that I want when my hair grows. It's gonna be freeform. Like I was telling y'all, semi freeform, so it's not gonna be completely freeform, but still gonna have some form to it some like def definition, but it's gonna be mostly free form, you know what I'm saying? It's not just gonna be straight down with locks coming on. No, I'm not having that. It's gonna be, you know, y'all yeah, gonna see. Similar to, uh, to St. John's. If y'all see my Instagram, I put it up on my stories. St. John's is, uh, Instagram, and he's a really uh, famous rapper and songwriter and whatnot. St. John's locks are like really what I'm going for. That's the look I'm going for, especially in the next six to eight months or a year. My hair, I'm gonna have that much volume of hair. Like obviously years down the line, I might have it just go straight down, but in the next six, seven months, that's the, the style I'm going for. So uh, I'm gonna get these retwisted tomorrow. And then after that, I'm gonna wait two more weeks and get them retwisted again. But after that part, so at the end of June, I'm not gonna uh, retwist them every two weeks no more. I'm gonna go. Uh, I'm gonna start going from two weeks, and I'm gonna jump to uh, monthly retwist, y'all. So I'm gonna share that with y'all on YouTube, of course. But um, I'm gonna stop doing two weeks because I feel like the locks need the breathing room to really do what they want to do. Because like, everybody's locks are different. My locks are not like most people's because my hair texture. My, I have 4C hair, y'all. So my hair kind of just twists and curls on its own without no type of products or, you know, what I'm saying anything so i don't need to have a special curling brush to make my hair curly it's just gonna auto curl that's just how it is so because of that um i don't have to do too much i just have to keep it to where it's looking neat so when it starts growing out more i might get like a little uh, slight lineup right here or something maybe but i'm not cutting off my sides i already told y'all that uh but yeah i'm just gonna let my hair do its thing because right now it's looking messy but it kind of looks cool y'all she's like freeform and you know it's, it's, it's separate though. You see, these are separate lines. It's not all just one big muck, you know? It's, it's clearly separate locks, but it's coming from the root. So you actually don't see my scalp anymore, which is what I want. I don't want you guys to be able to see my scalp, but tomorrow you guys will see my scalp. So I'm, I'll put the clip in here right after I get my retwist. I'll show you guys how my hair is looking. It's probably still gonna be product in it, so you're gonna see a little bit of product and whatnot because my hair is gonna be tightly twisted. You're gonna be able to see my scalp again. These are actually gonna look smaller because they're gonna be twisted all the way back up again. And you're gonna have to, and I might probably have to wait like a day or two after I put a little bit of water on my head with the uh, shower cap. Then they're gonna start slowly budding back up. But that's usually what happens to my hair. It looks all tiny, little, little tiny strips coming out everywhere, looking weird. And then once I put like water on it, two or three, four days later, I don't necessarily do a deep cleaning wash. I just put water on it just because I don't like when my head feels like there's like a ton of gel or any type of product on my head for days. It just, it just feels weird, y'all. So I put water on my head. It's like a nice quick rinse every like three or four days. You know what I'm saying? Just so my hair can really breathe and do what it's supposed to. Because actually, if you guys know, water really helps locks. Like if you put water in your hair, it's like the locks really open up, but also they lock, you know what I'm saying? So. They, it's like they breathe because my hair is actually alive you guys know this already my, my hair is like straight up alive so it's like a straight up tree branch y'all this is like my hair right that's, that's how my hair is it grows just like a tree so it's gonna grow up and it's gonna spiral it's gonna go all kind of crazy directions so i'm just gonna let my hair do my hair i was really impatient these the last two months i'm gonna really just fix that by just having more patience being less impatient and having more patience especially with my hair so i just want to show y'all what's going on this was almost, this one almost straight up came out. Look at that, that's just a, a block of hair. It almost, I gotta sometimes do this sometimes, just to realize that's a lot. But anyway, uh, this is where my hair is at right now. Tomorrow it's gonna be twisted back up, and then I'm gonna do one more retwist just to, just to, cause I, it's really important, you guys, especially for people who have locks of my size, like baby locks, it's really important to keep them defined because your hair has to remember how it feels being locked. 
when you don't retwist frequently, especially in the early days, it'll just puff back out to an afro. It'll unravel and your hair will just be just mucky, you know what I'm saying? So you have to keep retwisting so your hair can remember, okay, I'm supposed to stay like this. I can still be locked up, but I'm not supposed to be all one afro, you know what I'm saying, locked up. Because an afro locked up is just super nappy hair that can't be combed through and it's just a brick, you know what I'm saying? Some of you rock that, I can't rock a brick head, you know what I'm saying? I can't rock that. So. My hair can be a brick, but it's gonna be a bunch of small mini bricks that's styled, which is locks. You know what I'm saying? It sounds weird, but that's how it works. Your hair naps up and curls and locks up into cool styles. You see what I'm saying? So that's what I'm going for. So especially if, you, if your hair is like mine and you're on, your hair is really short, um, but your hair grows fast like mine, just keep retwisting every two weeks. And like I said, I'm two months and one week in, or two months and two weeks in now. So I'm almost three three months in. Right when my hair hits three month mark, I'm gonna stop retwisting every two weeks and I'm gonna do it monthly. I'm gonna show y'all how my hair grows and how it starts to look, okay? So yeah, this is the uh, two months in, and two months and two weeks in. And it's still kind of nice, y'all. My hair has grown dramatically, especially from day one. It was like literally micro. Y'all see, I'll show a picture right here of how my hair looked day one of me trying and then where it's at now like you can clearly see i have locks even from a distance it don't matter i look up i look that way you can clearly see i have locks so i already look like a different person and i love it i love this journey and this is just uh really showcasing what i've been learning this this whole time these two months i've really been changing my life working out learning martial arts eating better it's just so these locks really mean a lot to me it's, i mean originally it was just about me getting long hair but now these locks are like just uh, representation of the journey that I'm on. So the longer they get, the stronger, the bigger they get, just shows where I'm at in my life and where I, where I intend to go and how much I'm growing. So y'all stick with me. I'm gonna show y'all the growth and yeah. So thank y'all for watching. And this next clip's gonna be after the retweet. So yeah. All right, y'all. So this is how my hair is looking. Just came out of the shower. Um, as you can see, it's all crazy. Let me get a close up so y'all can see. It's like no separation, it's almost like a blob and stuff. That's like the tip of the lock and all that is just unraveled because of the water. And my eyes are red, but yeah, the water kind of just broke everything up. All the products is out. My hair is actually really clean now, so I, I uh, deep conditioned my hair. And it's still wet, so I'm gonna let it dry for like a good 10 more minutes. I don't want it to be completely dry, but I also don't want it to be super wet either. Get some of this water out. Ooh, I just feel like on my ear, but yeah. I want to show you all the process. This one's almost completely gone. So, yeah, this is my hair right out of the shower. And now I'm about to get that retwist. So, yeah, I'm going to show y'all how it looks as a retwist. So, next clip. All right, y'all. So, this is how my locks look after the retwist. I showed y'all yesterday how it looked right after the shower. So, it was all like fuzzy and whatnot. And my hair, I kind of slept wrong. So, the direction of my locks are kind of going everywhere now, but y'all can see clearly how they're not butted up. They're all tightened because of the, um, the gel and the jam I use. I'll show you guys the product later on, but in about a week or so, they're gonna start butting back up and you're gonna see, you're not gonna see my scalp anymore, but um, we're gonna do this one more time at the end of June. And then after that, I'm gonna go for the one month no retwist challenge. I'll show you guys that as well. But yeah, this is how it looks and yeah. So this is what, we're two months and two weeks in. All right, there we go. So yeah, thank y'all for watching. Make sure you subscribe, like the video, and uh, I'll, I'll upload another video in two weeks for the locks. So yeah, catch y'all later, peace.